Well, this is the end of the session, so it's nothing fancy going on. But <clears throat> what do you work? What what were you working on with Jake? Uh, just very early stages of recall. A very pressure. early stage of recall and what? Just him feeling pressure and then teaching him to turn to it. Okay, are you you're using both leash and remote? Yeah. Okay, so we have Sai, we have Samson over there. I forgot Maxwell was here too. Got some dogs walking around also. Good job, so Trying to teach Jake to work and drive up and stay focused on his end. What's up, 911, how are you? <laughs> um, so Andrew's doing that. What makes this so special is that we have Bella learning to be cool and collected and Bella's with us for a board and train because she recently sent a dog that she lives with to the ER. Um, and in reality, she's a very, very nervous, extremely fearful, um, kind of figure it out on your own, kind of lost in the world. Um, Andrew, uh, Laura wants you to give give her one good boy. You got any more food there? Yeah. Yeah, do one more. Same tone, don't change your tone, don't get fancy. <laughs> well, I appreciate it, Yoda. Yeah, we're gonna try to try to figure out how to do Facebook Live. We've been doing a couple of those. But Sai's hanging out. If you guys go back way back with us, you remember Sai and uh, all the controversy and the heat that we took because uh, he uh, he lunged at his owner's face and tore it up, and they were having a baby. Well, Sai and the baby have been doing great. They're gone right now. Well, we're gonna be doing both, but we're not choosing one or the other. Nine one one. We're, uh, we're still going to be doing these, but um, yeah, so Jackie goes way back with us. Jackie knows. Um, so that's kind of what we have going on. What I've yet to post is uh, Bella when she first kind of arrived, and even still outside, how incredibly like scared she is. So we'll get some, uh, we'll, we'll get some photo or, or some footage of that um, over the next couple days. And then we'll show you where Willie is, our, our main guy, Willie Nilly. Uh, one of the pups that we have going on who's doing really, really good. So lots of good things happening. I see the hearts are flowing. Um, unfortunately, we have, yeah, she's a weird, she's like a Catahoula or one of those kind of dogs. Really weird kind of looking dog. Um, but she's a sweetheart. She's just scared of the world when she's outside. I'm talking like she looks like Michael J. Fox and Muhammad Ali had a baby. And, um, and that baby was also extremely cold. So <laughs> picture Michael J. Fox, Muhammad Ali, and frigid temperatures shaking um, in the water in, during the Titanic scene. That's exactly how Bella looks when she's outside. Um, and it's sad, but I mean like she's also a flight risk. So what we're doing right now with her is you can't correct a dog like that, right? You can't... You can't say, no, don't be afraid, but we can start teaching certain behaviors and disagreeing with that. So what we're starting to teach now is, listen, I can't ask for perfect behavior on the walk because you're too out of it. What I can do is I can start teaching you when you're with me, if you're afraid, listen, I can't say don't be afraid, but I can show you to stay near me on a loose leash versus hitting the end of the leash. And if I didn't have a good grip, you'd run out into the street, get hit by a car. So it's like learning how to focus. I know you're nervous. Um, hopefully the weather starts getting a little bit nicer. It's like winter tricked us and was like, gotcha bitch, and it's back. Um, but uh, yeah, it, it was really cold today. Part of the reason why we actually didn't do the periscope of Echo outside is because when I went to do the periscope, um, the phone shut off because my phone froze. Uh, and, and killed the battery, but uh, we're about to get started with a group uh, group class. Uh, we got four four dogs in the group class. Yep. Every Wednesday night that is starting. Um, so uh, yeah, but anyway, so what we're doing with Bella is we're teaching her. Listen, just don't stay on tension. So we're disagreeing a little bit with tension, letting her hit the end of the leash, bringing her back, shutting tension off. What I really like to do is I'd like to get her to a point where. Um, I can order like a sandwich or something and listen, I know you're afraid, but just hang out and see the world kind of kind of hanging out, right? Um, see the world um, uh, like around you without like going nuts and freaking and trying to walk because movement right now is not necessarily beneficial for her. So it's like just just learn to hang. I know you're afraid, but don't bolt. Once we can keep her stationary, which is also partially why we're working on like place with her and having her learn to hang out while she sees stuff is that she knows that she can actually do that 
once we get that, we can begin to work on the foundations of the walk and then start to do more stuff in here, which she's getting better at, start to do more socialization and just get her more with us here in the brain because when she's kind of out there, she's kind of lost and she's so nervous. I think that's where the aggression comes from. She gets really, really scared and unsure, tails tucked, and then she kind of wants to lunge, kind of make that, that dog that she's nervous about go away. So that's what we have going on. We're gonna end up putting these dogs down. You guys saw Casper. Casper uh, is finally quiet down there for a little bit. Um, I'll have to, a lot of work on him. His skin is really, really bad. Um, yeah, we can, well, we're gonna be doing a form of flooding, but we have to understand like what's beneficial for her at this point. Um, so yeah, it's gonna be kind of flooding with teaching her to kind of relax during that kind of process. So I'm not gonna throw her in the middle of like Central Park, but I do want her to be around like some sounds in the distance, which we, we shouldn't have too much trouble with in New York City, while I just like eat a sandwich, hang out and plan on like sitting on a bench for an hour. What also helps is like, we have these windows here. So like between her and Jake learning how to see all like the traffic that at certain t times of the day and kids and stuff that walks by, you can learn how to just chill. So we're teaching her how to do that in here. We're gonna be bringing her outside to do more of that. And uh, that's pretty much kind of where we stand. Some news, I'm gonna post, I'm probably gonna do this within the next 15 minutes on our Facebook page our new blog, part one that we just put out, um, uh, the most abusive tool in dog training. I did a periscope on that. There's also a link to, um, to that video. Um, I'm sorry, a link to that blog that's gonna be coming out. We're gonna be giving you guys one blog a week. Um, this is gonna be our second blog. The first one was on the value, uh, the pros and cons of positive reinforcement. That's on there on the website. So I'll post the second blog within the next 15 minutes. We're gonna get going with this group class. DBQ Tuesday, we will have to put out tomorrow. Um, we just, we're, we're looking for a new dog walker and we're super busy. Andrew's been uh, kind of overload. Jen's been answering emails and setting things up and working here. Ozzy's been helping training this new girl, Kaylin, who's not hands-on with dogs yet. So all good stuff. I mean, it's a good problem to have. We're busy, but we are a little overwhelmed at the moment. So we have to kind of take a step back and, um, we will have the DBQ episode 32 out to you guys tomorrow. I promise new blog on the Facebook page will be posted. It's actually on our website, but we'll post that um, within the, uh, I would love a dog trainer. Yeah, but uh, you gotta come over here and uh, stuff is not cheap out here. So gotta find a place to live and all that. But uh, that's what we have going on. So bear with us, still trying to provide all that free information for you guys. and. Uh, I promise that will be out tomorrow, but the blog is going to be up tonight. See that on the Facebook page and on our website as well. All right, guys, I got a boogie. Later.